Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's Reggie Pegues. Total life changes. Totally changing my life. This is our next installment on how I plan to fire my job in the next 60 days. You know, we've covered several topics, but this morning I want to come to you and speak to you about vision. Vision. Scripture says where the people lack vision, they should surely perish. You got to have a vision. You got to have a vision. You got to have an idea. And you got to understand that with vision, God gives us vision. And when he gives you a vision, he also gives you the ability to fulfill that vision. So that's what I want to talk to you about today. God has given each and every person a vision. But do you know statistically that every person in the world has two to three ideas that can make them a multimillionaire, but they don't? become a multimillionaire because they never act on it. Don't let that be you. This morning, I want you to have vision. Every day when I get up at this time, and it's Monday morning, I've been up since three, and you know my story if you follow me, and I just dropped my daughter off and I'm on my way to work, but I wanted to take a few minutes out this morning to share with you, and, and I have a vision. When I get up this morning, I visualize the day where I don't have to do this anymore. I visualize what my life is going to be like. I visualize the house that my daughter and I are going to live in. I visualize us traveling. I visualize the blessing of God's life, God in my life and what he's doing. You can do the same thing. You have to have vision. You have to be able to see it. You have to see it so crystal clear in your mind, so razor sharp in your mind that there's nothing that will stop you from obtaining your vision. Now, that's not to say that you're not going to run into difficulties. That's not to say that people around you may try to discourage you. But I want you to understand something about vision. God gives vision to the committed, not to the committee. What does that mean? If God has given you a vision, be prepared that other people around you won't see it. Be prepared that other people around you won't understand it. Be prepared that other people around you may even try to discourage you. But I want you to understand, it may not be that they discourage you because they don't love you or they don't care about you. But you have to understand your vision, if you choose to accept it and become successful with it, will be a reflection. It will be a mirror on what those people are not doing in their own life. So vision, you gotta have vision. So just keep it in front of you. Keep it in front of you, write it down, write your goals down. Read them every day, recite them every day. And have vision and understand if God given you the vision, he's also giving you the provision to make it happen. So that's what we're talking about today. That's what this insert's about today. It's about vision. Have vision. As always, I thank you. I appreciate you. May God continue to bless you. And I'll talk to you later.